one pieces from our huge collection of uh, what we call deactivated and, and uh, replica firearms. This lady is a Lewis gun and uh, she in her day she had been capable of firing out about 500 rounds of 303 ammunition per minute. Uh, this one is, is, is incomplete because the, um, the cooling head here at the front is missing off it. Um, she's also been, been fully deactivated so unfortunately she's not capable of, of firing. Be probably about a year of about maybe 1900. These would have been used um, in the old biplanes. Uh, they'd been used by troops on the ground. Um, uh, we'll have this and a lot of other models uh, on display in the Stoll Arms Hotel for the um, Military Expo on, on the Bank Holiday weekend. Uh, as well as that, we'll have uh, uniforms, we'll have medals, we'll have uh, some nice, um, what we call, action men, um, soldiers, they're one fifth scale. There'll be um, oh, loads of its pieces. So I'll come along to the next one and have a look and have a chat with us. My name is Rico Stein. I'm a service officer with the American Legion, Father Francis Puff, Duffy Post II in Ireland. Uh, our organization was founded at the end of World War I to help and support veterans, U.S. veterans of foreign wars. As a service officer, I would help veterans and their families with entitlements and benefits uh, throughout our region. I'm here today with Jim Halpin, uh, looking at the museum he's about ready to open in preparation for the May 6th Expo, Expo on uh, World War I and uh, invite people to come down and look at it. It's fascinating. You see in the window here, we've got uh, ranges from all over the world, basically, involved with uh, the wars. And uh, I'm sure there's something to find that's interesting to everyone here. Thank you.